right, here we go. My amigos! When I first started voiceover, uh, I remember I had a roommate. He had just bought a home, and this home had two garages. So I took up one of the garages, and I put um, carpet in that garage, right? I was recording in a garage, so it didn't sound that good. The acoustics were crap, right? But I remember auditions coming in like crazy. I would get 40, 60, 80 auditions. And I would stress myself out like, oh my goodness, look at all these auditions I got to get to, boy. I got too much to do, kid. Got too much going on. I just had a lot of auditions being sent at me and I didn't know how to control it. For probably like the first year, this is like in 2006, 2005. I just... uh. I would pump out audition after audition after audition, and of course it wasn't good because I had just started. And I didn't realize that you don't have to audition for everything. You don't have to work for everybody. You don't have to try and sell everything. You just have to focus on one thing, one thing, just one thing. And I, I started focusing, and by the way, I got so stressed out over auditions that I stopped auditioning for a while. I went through a transition where I moved out of his home and I moved into a townhouse across town by myself, closer to the college where I was going to be attending. And it wasn't until eight months later after I started that I realized, oh, you know, stop auditioning for everything and just audition for the stuff that fits me. Teenagers, early 20s, late 20s, and early 30s. And Hispanic accented characters. When I started focusing on that, I realized, oh, this is how you do it. You don't have to audition for everything. Just audition for the stuff that you're really good at. Because when you audition for everything, you're spreading out your energy amongst things, amongst auditions that don't fit you anyway. Even if you have a bang out acting job on a particular job, but they want a 40 year old and you sound like you're 18, it doesn't matter how great your audition is, you're not going to book it because you're not what they want. So focus on the stuff that is for you specifically. Specifically for you and for you only. All right, my amigos! There is something that you are great at. You just have to figure out what that is. Once you figure out what you're great at, start pursuing that. Slowly you'll see the tides turn. Yes, that's right. The word of the day. Yeah, that's right. The word of the day. Knockwurst, a short, thick, heavily seasoned sausage. That's knockwurst, yeah! <laughs> Thank you so much for listening. That's all I got, my amigos! Yahoo! Oh, yeah!